Hi again. In today's video, we're going to do a uh, reveal or an unpacking of the uh, new Fluke 87.5 or V Max meter. This particular meter uh, differenti is differentiated uh, from the other uh, meters in the 87 line by the fact that this is uh, 67 rated, IP meaning ingress protection. Six meaning that it is essentially impervious to any penetration by dust. And seven meaning that it is waterproof up to one meter deep uh, for a period of about 15 minutes, which would certainly make it impervious to any situation you might uh, encounter if you left it out in the rain, for instance. Uh, after you take the uh, meter out of the case, uh, the, little, the little tray that it comes in holds the meter itself, which is uh, encased in a very rugged uh, fluke holster the, of the typical yellow uh, fluke color. This particular one is uh, protecting of the meter uh, to a fall of about 12 feet. Uh, so not only is the meter uh, impervious to environmental situations, uh, it also can uh, sustain a pretty good fall. Uh, the, there's a set of leads that, is, that are included. These are fluke IP, I'm sorry, these are Fluke TL175 twist lock leads. Uh, you'll see the way that they get their name is you can twist uh, this uh, the base of the, of the uh, probe tip itself and the sleeve will slide back and forth across the probe which allows you to go from a situation where you would only want a very small amount if you were in close quarters and measuring something up to the point where it would be completely open, uh, which is a more normal situation, or uh, the situation where you could insert your uh, alligator clip. These are AC-175 uh, Fluke alligator clips. Uh, again, there's a sleeve at the bottom. You just put the uh, probe right down on top of it and uh, press it in, and, and now you have a set of alligator leads. Of course, you would do the same thing on the red side with the red alligator clip. There's a, there are two uh, jack plugs. Uh, jack plugs are uh, intended to fit down inside the current uh, jacks uh, to prevent debris or foreign material from falling inside the meter uh, if you're in a fairly harsh environment. The other thing that is, is worth note is uh, the uh, thermocouple assembly. This particular thermocouple assembly is designed to fit right inside the, uh, the, the jacks themselves. Uh, you would turn the meter to the temperature setting, hit uh, the orange key that will take you into temperature. Uh, you can see that right at the moment in the, in the lab it's about 25 and a half degrees uh, centigrade. A uh, good way to find out if it's working correctly is just grab the tip and you will see it increase as it is worn by my fingertips. The documentation that is in the box, uh, there are several pieces of, uh, of paper. Uh, safety, uh, the safety information uh, sheet is important and is written in several different languages. Uh, but the one that probably most people will work or uh, will look at uh, is the uh, little user's guide, uh, which kind of goes through step by step as how you uh, operate the meter. We will do another video on the operation of this particular meter which is also applicable to other flute meters. A uh, last piece of paper, and I'm going to hold this one up pretty close because this uh, QR code will lead you to the manual uh, for the, uh, for the Fu Fluke 87.5. Again, if you are working in a hostile environment or one where you want to protect the meter from intrusion of dust or water, a uh, Fluke 87.5 Max uh, is the one we would certainly recommend.